Hello everybody, welcome back to Dishonored. Um, now I do apologize because again the audio is, it, it sucks but in this video. But I'm working on trying to improve it. Just be patient. Um, this episode is a little bit shorter because I have spent a lot of time dilly-dallying and uh, not much time trying to progress in the game. So, um, the next episode to come out after this should be a little more in-depth to the game. With that being said, and please enjoy the video. We'll do just one more mission. Uh-huh. Debakva. You seem like my grand. You act like my grandpa, Samuel. Mm -hmm. You look like John Mulaney. Hello? Trevor? Trevor Phillips? Whale oil? Yep. Ooh. No. Oh. Okay. Let's have a look. What do you got? Okay. Crossbow arrows, of course. Um sleeping darts, okay. Bullets. Spring razor, a trap that can be placed near Okay, so just like a trap. A grenade. Okay. Why does it have a there's a straw sticking out of it. And rewire tool allows you to rewire circuitry and chain and turn security systems to your advantage. Consumed on usage. Okay. Upgrades. Crossbow accuracy lowers the dispersion and stabilizes crossbow aim. I mean, as far as I know, it's pretty accurate, but you know. Bolt capacity. Mask optics allows you to magnify your view. Press left alt to zoom. Low key, that would be sick as fuck. I'm 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 kind of fucking with the the mask op optics. We're gonna go with that. All right. Oh, is it just? Okay, yeah. Hello. Oh, what? Strange gravity. Oh, wait, am I supposed to go out the door? What the fuck? 
Oh, this has got to be a dream. Hello? Okay, I'm seeing a lot of resemblance to different characters in this game. I felt like I needed to call that out. Ew. Equipping the heart in your left hand helps you locate bone charms or runes even through walls. Okay. The heart beats and lights up when facing a bone charm rune and it beats faster as you get closer. The heart will whisper secrets if you press left click while targeting a personal location. Okay. What is this like? Oh, what the hell? Oh, wait, no. I'm just fucking stupid. Oh, chest. Piero's Spiritual Remedy? Okay. Rune. Oh, it's glowing. Uh-oh, uh, oh, once you've collected some runes, open a journal and go to the power section to exchange them for powers. Okay. Um, powers, alright, link, see in the dark and see living beings through walls, including their fields of vision, representation and sound that you are making are also visible, okie dokie, vitality, health is increased, and health regeneration, oh, well, no, that's level 2, can't get that yet. I'm gonna go with dark vision. Yeah. Press left click to see in the dark to reveal living beings through solid walls. You can also see their fields of view as well as a visual representation of the sound you make. Okay. Cool beans. Jesus, okay. Come now. Create lead to defeat enemies, move to environment, blink from roof to roof, possess rats and fish, slow time before rushing groups of enemies. Bro, what? Powers. Devouring swarm. Summon a swarm of rats that will attack others, then disperse after a short duration. The swarm also consumes the corpse. Wind blast. Powerful wind that can push back or knock down enemies. Okay. Shattered doors? Damn. Okay. Unaware enemies who don't see you turn to ash as they die. Okay. Well, that's nice, I guess. Jump height is increased and falling damage is reduced. Okay, that's nice. Build up adrenaline, then trigger brutal melee fatalities. Allows to control animal targets for a short duration. Okay. Well, that's nice. Slows time. So, that's nice. Well, alright. Wait, hold on. I, I forgot. I... And I can't get those yet. Obviously because I don't have enough runes, but, you know. Okay. Oh, hello.
Okay. Go with a grenade, maybe. All right, let's go. No, I gotta say, for a game that came out in 2012, this is a pretty in-depth game. Well, let's go. I gotta put on my mask. 